Kalina, I have never met anyone named Kalina. It's such a pretty name. Thank you. It means daughter in Australian Aborigine. Have you ever met anybody else named Kalina? Well, yes, but it was spelled with a C. I see. Well, it was spelled differently than mine. It was at a restaurant here in New York. How did your parents happen to name you Kalina? Well, they were in Africa, and they were with a friend, and the friend was talking to some people, and they heard Kalina, and they loved it. it. Do you have a nickname? Does anybody ever call you anything else? Well, yes. Most people don't call me that, but some people do. Kaylee. Kaylee? Which do you prefer? Kaylee. Kaylee. You're going to have a new little sister, I understand. Mm -hmm. Have they picked out a name yet for the sister? Well, not yet, but there's a few of them, but my favorite one of all of them is Tanya. Tanya. What are some of the other names they're considering? Rebecca, Malia, Kira, Katasha, Katia, and that's all. That's all, but you're going to vote for Tanya. Do you think you'll win? Maybe. Okay. Kalina, in, in Love, Sydney, of course, you're playing with Tony Randall and Susie Kurtz. Are they anything at all like your own mother and father? Oh, yes. They're so nice. They're the nicest people I ever met. Well, just about. In what way is Tony like your own daddy? Well, he teaches me a lot. And my dad teaches me a lot. My dad teaches me a lot about birds and animals. And Tony teaches me a lot about acting and life, just like Susie does. What does Tony teach you in acting? For instance, if you're in a scene, does Tony tell you how to make it better or? Yeah, like to pay attention to him. Like when it's a scene, just me and him tells me to pay attention to him only and not to look at the camera and for me to concentrate on what he's saying. And do you do that? I try as hard as I can. What's the hardest thing you've ever had to do in Love, Sydney? Well, it was this last show we did. Well, I shouldn't really tell, but um, I was supposed to be in a scene where I had to be really quiet. I was asleep. I was really gone, and I was supposed to wake up at one part. And I would always, like, itch myself or move around. But I would do that when he was not in the room so that um, I wouldn't bother him. And so that was difficult, huh? Kind of. Are crying scenes difficult for you? Pretty hard because I don't really cry much about it. It's like on E.T. where Drew and everyone cries. They have real tears because it's really sad. Did I've you? seen it five times. Did you cry? Do you cry in E.T.? Mm -hmm. I do too, but uh, it's kind of in a way, happy tears, aren't mm -hmm. they? They're tears of, of happiness as well. Except the part when he got sick. Yes, that was, that was no fun. That mm -hmm. was no fun. Kalina, when you're not doing a scene, in between scenes, mm -hmm. what do you do then to pass the time? Well, I eat a little bit and I go to the bathroom while I have time. And I give us five minutes to do that. And then we have to go back on the set. So what you're saying is you don't have a lot of time between right. scenes. Yes. But when you're away from, from the set, what do you like to do just for fun, just for Kalina? Um, I like to play with my stand-in. Who is that? Her name's Melanie Halbert. And what do, you, what do you play? Well, I have some games there, and we play the games. Or we read books. Or we play with our Barbies. Does it, when you're doing the work, Kalina, does it ever get boring to you? Well, kind of, but most of the time it's pretty fun. 
Is it boring when the director says, take three, take four, take five? Does that get boring? No, because he doesn't have one of those things. Oh. Um, but we do the scene three times every day. No, we do it about five times every day. Like, we do the show twice before a run-through for the writers, and then we do the run-through for the writers. So that would be sh three shows a day. And also, on Wednesday, I mean, Tuesday, we have to do two shows. But no, really three. But I ha don't have to come in until 12. You get half a day off then. Mm -hmm. Well, Kalina, it's nice meeting you, and I hope you get that new little sister. And don't tell your parents, but I hope they call it Tanya. <laughs> Thank you.